guys, I'm back with another video, and today I am going to be doing a review on my new fidget spinners. So I have two of them right here, and these are the last two I'm going to get. And I chose both rainbow metal ones. At the time, when I first was getting my first three, I did not know that they, ha that they even made rain rainbow metal ones. But so yeah, we'll get right into this. So... I'm going to start out with the one that did not come in a case. I put this rag in there. Rag in there, I just found it. Anyway, but, so, if you open the bag, the bag is not the best quality, but then you have the spinner. Put that out. And first looks on the spinner, there are hand fingerprints on it. I did not get this one today. I got this one a couple of days ago, so I've just been playing with it. And one, and I'm not going to be doing a spinner box because not all of them have came yet, and it's gonna take way too long of a time. And I'm not, I don't really want to make a box because I can't really find a box. But yeah, hold on, guys, for a second. Sorry guys, my dog was chewing something up. <coughs> anyway, guys, anyway guys, like I said, <laughs> I have been playing with this and it's a cool spinner, I have to say. And if I'm gonna grab a spinner, I just wanted to say it is a lot smaller compared to like these ones. And pull that off to the side. And it's really silent on the table. If you guys can see that. It's pretty silent. I'll put it up to the camera. Can't really hear it. The caps, I'm not sure. Those are not not that heavy, so I'm going to assume they're not metal. But if you just take this, like, it sounds like it's part metal, but I don't really think it is. Anyway, but then we'll get with the body. This side has, like, um, bluish, purplish, and then there's a guard here. I'm not sure what that's for. Then on this side, it's, like, green and turquoise. And then they have these holes on the sides. I'm not sure what those are for. I'm just guessing you guys could probably use those for like if you want to put a neck make a necklace out of this. And I'm guessing why would you want to do that? But these are screw-on caps. We'll take a look at the bearing. The bearing is pretty tiny. You want to show yours? The bearing's pretty tiny. My brother actually just got his today. You guys can see a glimpse of it. Yeah, my brother will show you guys a glimpse of the um, spinner he got. You guys can. There it is. That's a glimpse. Guys, go check out his channel, Adrian G. He's going to be posting a video on that, I think. Anyway, but you can just. This only spins for a minute. I can do spin tests on some of these. This one, this one in the case, I have not tested out for spin test. So. And you can't really hear the caps, but the caps are a little wobbly, but not too bad. Anyway, just put it back in there. Close up the case. That closed. Okay. We got this one out of the way. Now, you have this one. If you open up the case, the inside has this little screwdriver in a packet. And then the spinner itself. This one I have been waiting for. And I love that noise. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Okay. And there's, I've been playing with this for quite a while. 
The caps are pretty thick compared to these ones, but these ones are like, a, these ones have, this one has a little bit thinner ones and these ones are a lot thicker. And the difference with these are that these are um, metal. I think the other ones are metal, but they're really halfway made out of metal. Same with this one right here. Pretty much the same colors on the side. And so we'll unscrew the caps off and put that to the side real quick. Now, you can definitely hear that these are, um, you guys can't see it, but you can definitely hear that these are metal. And I like how they have the in engravements or the indents, indentations. Um, this one also has the indentations, which feels really good for tricks. I don't really do tricks with those, anyway. But the bearing is pretty much the same size as the last one. And I know if you guys can see those screws. This is also a guard, but I don't know if you guys can see these screws. I think that's why they gave us this screwdriver. If you want to take out the bearing to, like, clean it or something, if something gets in it. And this is called the Delta Spinner. I didn't tell you guys the name of this one. This one's called a Bar Spinner. I don't know why, but some people say it's the Lamborghini type of fidget spinners, which I find pretty weird and interesting. I have not spin tested this one yet, but I like how there's these little holes on that, on like the sides. And then there's like these little lines, which feels real nice. And it is indeed um, metal, so that's good. So if we just screw these on, when it's in your hand, it makes that cool um, metal noise, but on the table, it's really loud, but it's pretty cool at the same time. Um, it's pretty balanced for the most fact. You just have to, it's pretty balanced for the most fact. You just have to get it, um, the caps on right, because if you don't get them on right, it's not going to be balanced. From the side, it looks cool. See, and if you take this outside, it'll look really cool because it's in the sunlight, which is going to be cool. And the cool part is that you can fit actually fit two fidget spinners in here, one there and one there. And you can spin that in the case, too. It's not going to spin long, though, because of these parts right here, which stops the spinner. So, yeah. And then... That's pretty much it for the most fact. I mean, there's re nothing really more. It's really heavy, though. This one's got a tight uh, little bit of touch to it. But I'm just going to wrap the video up, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. And if you guys are new, don't forget to subscribe for daily videos. And I just want to say, guys, um, I will be probably posting Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. Uh, today is thir today's Thursday. Yeah. Anyway, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.